Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. In the previous video, I have already described about the normal ECG pattern. Now in this video, I am going to tell you about some abnormal ECG patterns. So in the first ECG, you can see the PR interval is variable. That means atria and ventricles are working independently. So the most likely diagnosis is heart block. The second, you can see there is no POF. There is no POF. So ventricles are basically out of control from the XA node. So this condition, the possible diagnosis is ventricular tachycardia. In the next ECG pattern, you can see there is missing of POF. Here is one POF, a POF is missing. Then again you can see POF and all of these are irregular. So this is most likely due to that small infraction in myocardium that disrupting the normal electrical conductivity of heart which basically gives us a diagnosis of excess stone. In the next CCG you can see there is again no POFs and the QRS complex is also irregular. right? So the most likely diagnosis is atrial fibrillation. The next ECG pattern you can see there is no QRS complex so it is most likely due to ventricular fibrillation. The next ECG you can see there is regular POF but the QRS complex is half or quarter than the atrial rate. So the most likely diagnosis is atrial flat. Other than that you can also get a flat ECG reading that means there is no electrical changes and there is also no contraction of myocardium. So this basically suggests asystole and that means the patient is dead. Thank you for watching. Please consider subscribing the channel for more contents like this.